Hello, this is IEPS, sir, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! Alright, so last time, I mean, here's my setup for now, and hey, well, I forgot to equip relics to set, sir. Here, l well, let's take care of this real quick. Um, it doesn't really matter what you throw on them, and I guess I'll throw e e EXP egg and Zephyr Cape. Pretty much e e p e e ah, EXP egg to get him to learn some stuff. I almost said EPSXE for some odd reason. <laughs> and I have um, Realm on Tritalk. That's the only big difference I made. I have her on Tritalk so she can learn the level 3 spells and get that magic power bonus. Like, and she really needs all the help she can get. Yeah. So in order to trigger this side quest, we need to have Strago and Realm in our party. And we need to go to Thamasa here. Yeah, we've been here millions of times, so let's go. Hey, where are you going? And I just suddenly turned into Strago. That's kind of freaky. Yeah, I'm sorry for this episode being shortened, too. I just get really frustrated and quit. <laughs> Grandpa! What? This is terrible. Gung-Ho is hurt. Gung-Ho! No! What's wrong with him? Gung-Ho, are you okay? Wake up, you old hag. Did you just... I don't know what I'm thinking of. Hydon! You took on Hydon! Well, we haven't heard about him in... <laughs> forever. I don't even know if you all saw it. I don't know if it was a side thing or not. I don't know. <sighs> I'm sorry, I just really like to get into character. <laughs> Are you okay, Gramps? <laughs> Quit hesitating. Let's go kick this gung-ho's butt. I mean, <laughs> sorry, gung-ho. Hydon. What's a pos What's the worst you could be? Some flesh-eating zombie? Haha, <laughs> no. We ain't putting up with creepers here. Grandpa- It did it again, viewers! <sighs> Went through the whole thing and I cut off there. I really need to get a better computer. Anyway, I spent too many years of my- <laughs> Life obsessing about this guy. You can't just come and do what you think you do. Yeah, you can't. You can't just come and beat this guy up. No, it won't work like that. And I really don't know what the problem is with my mic here. I mean, it's not my mic, it's my computer because the mic works perfectly on my other one. But, I mean, it just only picks up like half of the narration, or in this case, two minutes of it. Yeah, I mean, that's it. It's all it does. Just picks up two minutes. Like, here's what I do. I record the thing, sit down, put it to Movie Maker, sit down, narrate through the whole thing, through every bit of it, all ten minutes, and then when I'm done, I look over, and it recorded what I said, just the first two minutes, and then completely cut off the rest. And it doesn't even tell me while I'm recording. Don't know why, it just doesn't. I mean, if you all know a fix to this, please tell me. I mean, I have no idea what's going on. I mean, I don't know if it's storage issues or something. I don't know. I mean, I really wish I did know so I could make it stop. But I, if y'all have any ideas, let me know. Yeah. If, any ideas at all. And it makes me so mad that I have to do a marathon on this Let's Play and put up with this issue a lot. Yeah, so... Sorry about that. I accidentally unplugged my microphone this time. This computer's a piece of crap. I hate it so much. Anyway, yeah, you have to go around and get coral pieces for this thing on the teleporter pad. If you go to random parts of the cave, and whenever you do, you just get something random, I guess. You get pieces of coral, and you have to make sure you have 22 pieces and give it to them. No, you can't get 20, and then give... Um, two to him later. No, you have to do it all at once, or else he'll make you start all over. Yeah, that's just how it works. Yeah. Not much to do in this dungeon. Just kill these things. I don't know strategy to them. So, there's nothing much to do, I guess. I mean, Jesus Christ, it makes me mad, man. <sighs> So, I'm gonna bore you. I'm bored. Don't worry, viewers. It makes me mad and bored to go through this thing two times in a row. Yeah. 
so I'm probably just going like I have no idea it'll randomly not do it and then it'll randomly do it so if you all know a solution to this please let me know I don't know what's going on man I just can't wait for this let's play to be over so I don't have to put up with this issue for the rest of my life and this computer will just sit here and sleep it can Freaking sleep for all I care. I don't need it anymore after this let's play. My laptop will be the one that'll probably mess up it. <laughs> you know, I probably should have thought about this before using a five year old computer to do these. Yeah, I'm using a five year old computer to do this let's play, and I used it to make four. You're probably wondering how I pulled it off, how this piece of junk here can run the fraps and the emulators and stuff but yeah it did, it did yeah some of you have also been asking me IPSer where in the world do you get your emulators and ROMs I told you um in a video before um it was my EPSXE tutorial but um I'll go ahead and tell you again I get my ROMs from coolrom.com yeah um where I get those. Um, I usually surf through those, and they pretty much have every ROM for every system they have, every single game for them. So that's pretty nice. But for the games, ROMs they they don't have ROMs for every single system. Like they don't have ROMs for uh, Nintendo 64. They don't have ROMs for um. Well, I know there's another one. I just can't put my finger on it quite right now. I don't think they have any for um. Dreamcast, no, no, I, I, yeah, 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 they do. Cool ROM does, but there's others that don't. But um, anyway, um, I go to Dope ROMs if Cool ROM doesn't have this ROM systems, and Dope ROMs always never lets me down either. That's where I get all my N64 ROMs. Yeah, um, play all those games. Yeah, and the Nintendo 64 is just a good system. I miss that system. I actually. Didn't feel like playing an emulator the other day and actually hooked up my old Nintendo 64 and played it a little. Played some Pokemon Stadium, Super Mario 64, Kirby 64, I think that's what it's called. Yeah, I had a good day. Let's see what kind of games I have on it. Well, I know I'm probably boring you guys right now, but what else is there to do? We're just going around collecting coral for somebody. Yeah, I pulled out my drawer of games here for the Nintendo 64. Yes, I have a whole drawer full of them. Well, it's pretty much drawer and Super Nintendo games, which is useless because it takes less than a second to get a freaking, um, ROM. But anyway, I have two copies of Mario Kart 64 for some odd reason. Got Banjo-Kazooie, Banjo-Tooie, um, Clay Fighter 63 and one third for some reason. That's kind of weird. I have Super Smash Brothers. I have Mario Party 1. I have Mario Party 2. I have Mario Party 3. I have Super Mario 64. Yeah, I got quite a bit of cool games here. Now, what y'all are wondering, IPS or quit rambling on about something we don't care about. What am I going to talk about? I've already pretty much said everything that has to be said this episode. So, let's see kind of, um, wait. Oh, God, I'm almost out of time. That would suck if I just didn't look at the time, huh? Got Super Nintendo games here. Huh. Got ooh, Kirby's Dream Land 3. I love that game. Um Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, I got some pretty good games here. I'm probably gonna have to play some Mario Party later. Yeah, I love Mario Party. Some Mario Kart. Yeah. Good mint good times, good times. But yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> um but really, what do you want me to talk about? Just narrate? Go down. Going down. Going up. Using Fire 3 now. But yeah, we're going to want to use Fire on 3. I do need to explain something about these guys, though. If you do not use something on them fast enough, they'll use a spell on you and get rid of your vanish status, which we need. And, um, well, I kind of just punched them in the face with some fireballs and big bolts of flare. Huh. <laughs> So that works for me. Yep. <laughs> All right, get out of my friggin' way, you little mother frigger. No, no. Ah! Don't give him the coral. Don't give him the coral. 
All right. Um. Anyway, I've ran out of time for this episode, so I'll get the rest of the coral off screen. I'll meet you back up there at the hungry, hungry hippo. <laughs> so um, I'll see you all next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. This is IPSer signing out. Have a nice day.